Oh, there was a bass. Oh, don't you dare. Kidding me? What did he get me stuck on? God dang it. First fish of the day. Finally, that's a nice one too. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Finally. Finally, guys, it took all day to catch one. Worth it, though, about dang time. Little guy, and less than a pound. Had to switch up tactics quite a few times to pull it off, but hey, worth it. Urgh. So, tried various things. I just went to a soft bait with the Texas rig. And I'm just slow retrieving it along the bottom. And that's about the maybe fourth bite. I did have another hookup, but I lost that one because it found one thing to snag up on. But finally, let's see if I can catch another one. I have a feeling there's more than one in this spot. 
But all I'm doing is literally just fishing right between these logs. But boy, they're biting super soft today too. Oh, missed him. Son of a gun. That was another bite in the same spot. They're stacked right there. That one felt just as big. Oh, he took my leg. Bugger. That felt like another decent one, so we're going to get back in there. Right about there. That one goes that way, so there should be a fish somewhere over there. Oh yeah, oh yeah, here we go, now we're on to it, holy smoke do they have some fight to them today. Where's my hook, can't tell. Kind of gut hooked him a little bit there, but he'll be okay. Come on, phone. Another little one, not as big. Don't think it's the same one I just caught. <laughs> Have any luck? No, it, it's been a shit show. Yeah, I. The only two I've caught in so far are off the trees. I have not had a bite anywhere else on the lake on anything here the four that we caught were all from here to the next push is over yeah and, and that, you know fishing the jerk bait in that corner i had one itty bitty like little six inch bass come up and give me a whack yeah but i mean normally you know they pound the spy bait no matter what condition and you know no luck no i've seen a lot of dead bass though i uh, think this uh, winter was really hard on them yeah because yeah i've only had any hits on the trees and that was it they didn't have any other bites today. Normally, like this general area is what warms up first because it's got the least wind and yeah. the sun. But. Yeah, I always catch them here and I haven't had any bites today. Yeah. And I've tried lipless, I've tried a jig, and I've had no luck. I'm just using a soft bait. That's it. <laughs> and even then, the bite's still super slow. Yeah, yeah, drop shot would work. They're really aggressive, but I, I don't know why they're just sitting on the trees. Yeah. Well, that's what I thought they were gonna be doing today. I figured they'd be moving around, but I haven't seen anything other than those couple I caught on the trees. Yep. Have fun. Try to catch something. Yeah, try to have fun. <laughs> 
Hey guys, so it was a fairly slow fishing day today. Only caught two. Uh, I hooked into another one and it wrapped the line around something. I'm not even sure what. I couldn't even see what the line was wrapped around. I could see the line. Got away. Seeing all day were just the few that were on the trees or the laydowns. I didn't see any fish anywhere else in the lake today. I tried the lip list, didn't get any bites on that. I tried a jig, didn't get any bites on that. I had one chase it, but it didn't bite it. Just a Texas rig crawfish. That's the only thing I got a bite on today. That's what I actually caught the two on. The only thing that they were hanging on were the laydowns and I couldn't find fish anywhere else. It was still a really good day. The water temperature was a lot higher than I thought it was going to be. It was actually 48 degrees. When I first went out there, that was at, at like 9 o'clock in the morning. So it, it was st still a little cold, but getting near the 50 degree mark, they start to get really active up here. Um, hoping some of the other water will unfreeze here pretty soon and we can get out on the boat and start actually serious bass fishing. It, I, I'm kind of worried that's going to be a bad year because we had some arctic freezing temperatures and I have a feeling that might have killed off some of the bass. I, when I was walking around the lake fishing I saw a lot of dead bass just sitting on the bottom of the lake which is not a very good sign plus with how few I caught and how few bites I got today on stuff that I know I should have been getting more bites on and then talking to John who was also out there he said it's been pretty slow for him too and he hasn't been catching a whole lot baits in that lake so anyways i'm gonna end this video wrap it up eat some burgers it's gonna be good and hopefully i can get out i don't know if i'm gonna be able to get out again tomorrow it's supposed to be rainy and snowy but we'll see if it's not too bad i'll get out and try to make some more video it would be the same lake again so see you guys in the next video.